Hey y'all, it's Kayla's Corner back with another video. Uh, I thought I'd switch it up and do like a Q&A about me type stuff. So um, on Instagram, um, I asked you guys to send me questions and just ask me stuff. So let's get to it. I have my questions on my laptop because phone. <laughs> okay, so favorite place I've traveled. Oh, I'm sorry. Favorite place I've lived. Uh, favorite place I've ever lived. This is already so hard. <laughs> um, I'll give it to New York. Uh, there was always something to do. And um, I always meet the coolest people out there. Shout out to Zara. Um, <laughs> my dream job. Um... I don't know if I, I'm not good at that. I don't know if I'm as creative as <laughs> I used to be. Um, I don't know, I'd say maybe a painter. I feel like I like painting and I do it a lot more if I had the time. Yeah, we'll see, we'll, we'll say painter. Favorite thing I bought in the last six months? Um, okay, it's gonna sound pretty like, are you serious? But uh, I, I got Smile Direct to like straighten my teeth. I don't wanna see no comments that say my teeth are straight cause don't lie. But, <laughs> but I got that and they're basically like Invisalign and they like straighten that whole joint. Um, maybe this is like the, like my mature side peeping through. <laughs> But uh, yeah, they're fixing my teeth and I kind of like it. <laughs> um, okay. What do I seek in life? Like a good nap. I don't know. I feel like when I was a little kid, like those naps used to hit. Like you'd be knocked out for like 20 minutes and it's just wake up feeling like a whole new four year old. Um, I feel like my naps don't hit like that anymore because there's always like an alarm or like something to be like, shouldn't you be doing this? But yeah, that's what I seek in life. Like a, like a super decent nap. Where do I currently live? I live in Chicago. I uh, moved out here a little while ago for school and then I graduated, so like I'm here. <laughs> Chicago, Illinois. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, tea or coffee? I really like tea and not even like the whole, you know, put milk in it and do all that extra stuff. No, I just, some good old steeped for seven minutes tea. Uh, I'm big on citrus, so anything like lemony, lemon, ginger, and turmeric. Those are my top three. If you put them all together, whoo, steal my heart, okay? Uh, coffee, I've only had coffee once in my life. Ooh, I know, weird, 20-something year old who doesn't drink coffee. Uh, I had it one time in Sao Paulo, that's uh, Brazil. Um, it was my birthday and like the house um, help like made me some coffee. And it was it's kind of rude to you like say no. So I drank it. I didn't like it. <laughs> she was really sweet though, so I know like she she had good in her heart. <laughs> Tea all day, y'all. PC or Mac. PC get no, I'm playing. Um <laughs> uh, I used to be PC all day, all night. Um I got this Mac because it like syncs stuff with my iPhone like so conveniently I still do prefer PCs I feel like they have better specs but I guess I'm a drone Apple gang now um, but yeah don't sleep on Galaxy Notes though those phones are I, I love them I love them so much do I have any bad habits I bite my nails I really do I don't know what's up with that I don't know, somebody drop a tip or something. I just, I've been biting my nails since I can remember and it's just, there's no way to stop it. I think it's here at this point. Um, my nails are growing 
they look good to me <laughs> so i'm like every day trying not to bite them uh any other bad habits i like to whistle like and i go off like i'm like i don't care what nobody said like i'm a really good whistler like i could do a whole full length song and you will know the song i'm whistling to because i'm that badass they be hating on me at work but they just mad they don't got the you know skills whistle queen in the house um one thing you wouldn't know about me I have over a dozen siblings. I get half siblings, whatever you want to call them. But um, yeah, I have like over a dozen siblings. Um, I have lived in over 18 cities. Also gone to 18 or 19 schools my whole life. No, I'm not an army brat. No, I don't wish to be an army brat. It's just life mostly childhood though i'm pretty stable now but um yeah i don't know if that'll come back up later but i'll get back to it if y'all want me to craziest thing i've ever done i wonder if this is like craziest like experience or like something like i've actually actually done I don't, mmm, craziest thing I've ever done. Maybe I'm not that crazy, y'all. Um, I went to Amsterdam with my great sis, Alba, my baby, my person. Uh, I went to Amsterdam with her and she'll deny it as long as she lives, but we definitely almost got kidnapped. That was crazy. Um, it was basically these two local Amsterdamish, Netherlandish, Hollandish, I don't know what you call people from Amsterdam. Um, those two, like this guy and this girl, like trying to drag us to the red light district, like under any means possible. And if you know about the red light district, then you know. Um, but yeah, that definitely happened. I don't know if there's anything else crazy that I've ever done. Find out next time. What theme parks have I been to? I have been to both Disney's. I've been to the one in Orlando like two times. One when I was a child, one when I was a little older. Uh, I went to the Disney in Anaheim. I think I went there twice as well. Um, that was great. I went to Universal in both Florida and Cali. That was great. I think I prefer the one in Cali though. I've been to Bush Gardens. You can never like don't ever like try and dump on Bush Gardens around me. That's that was my joint. It's like educational fun. Like uh I learned so much at Bush Gardens. Like you wouldn't have thought I was at a park. I'm just sitting here like dissecting words and geographic elements. It was, it was Bush Gardens. B-U-S-C-H Gardens. I think it's in like Virginia or something. That's lit. Um, I've been to like a bunch of Six Flags. Um, I haven't been to the one out here in Illinois. Um, but I've, I, I've been to like most of the Six Flags, like however many Six Flags there are on the East Coast, like I, I've done it. <laughs> um, Dorney Park, shout out Bethlehem, PA, shout out uh, Allentown, PA, Lehigh Valley, Upper McCungy, Brownsville, Gang Gang. Um, yeah, if, if you know, you know that way outside of philly ass city like <laughs> don't get me started on allentown yo um but i've been to dorney that one's cool uh it's less cool when you're in the middle of a loop-de-loop -loop and the ride just stops at the top and not like it's supposed to stop like there has been a malfunction your life may be in danger put your hands back in the vehicle and wait for further assistance that has happened way too many times. Like, at this point, you just go to the you just go to Dorney for like the fair type snacks. That's it. Cause like getting on that ride, like <laughs> you gotta have life insurance at this point. They are woo. <laughs> Favorite genre of film. 
Okay, this one's hard for me because I, I feel like I hate every movie I, I see. Like, it takes a lot for me to like a movie. Favorite? I think it would be like anim mm, just animated films. I'm not that big on Disney though, but like DreamWorks and Pixar? Pfft, amazing. Um, I would say that you'd probably not get, you probably wouldn't get me to like admit it. So this footage doesn't exist. Um, I also, it's weird because I don't watch that many horror films at all. So somebody put me on, but like I really like horror films, mostly because I feel like it's kind of hard to scare me. Like I'll, I'll jump a little, ooh, like you got me. But like for me to be like, like let me research, you know, when my building was da -da -da, developed and figure out if there's like a ghost or a dead night, nah. I've never been like that scared. Um, based on a true story, does not shake me. <laughs> um, so I really like horror films. Um, if you trick me into watching or like a romantic comedy, like I'ma like it, I won't tell you. <laughs> I watched the photograph um, with my twin Kayla and we were so disappointed y'all. So don't drag us in the comments, Black History Month, ooh ooh. But um, we had such high hopes for that movie. I was even like, maybe I should just see it again. Cause we, there was clearly something we missed. It was way deeper than we thought. We just didn't catch it. We tried to blame ourselves for not liking the movie. It was just, ooh. Um, comedies are always a plus, but like, I don't know. I say I prefer stand up comedy to like comedy specials. And, well, no, comedy specials are. I prefer stand up comedy to like sitcoms, but I do really like sitcoms, y'all. That Those aren't movies. I just missed the whole point of the question. Next question. <laughs> My dream job when I was a kid. Oh, this is an interesting one. I wanted to be a mashup between an astronaut and Beyonce. That's all. End of story. Do we, do we even need to go further? <laughs> Look, I really wanted to be an astronaut, but I had to be Beyonce and not like like on some like Hannah Montana before that ever even existed, I was like three and I was like, both of them. Teachers like, what do you wanna be when you grow up? Both of them. Like, <laughs> um, I wanted to be an astronaut cause it was just something that people always said was like really, really hard to do. You know, I was and I was just difficult. I was like, okay, I'm gonna do it then. I'm gonna do it. It's not rocket science, but it is, but it is. And then Beyonce was Beyonce like, I had, I was like big on those like female, like pop and R&B singers. Um, Beyonce, Left Eye, Aaliyah, and Eve. Like my top four still to this day probably. <laughs> um, yeah, so Beyonce was just the most known one. I would always find like her pictures and stuff. So she just became the image in my head. So I was like, I'm gonna go to space but I'm gonna sing out there. I'm gonna sing for all the aliens. Ain't gonna be no beef. Like, we gonna be good. They gonna, we gonna go to Mars like on vacation, on holiday. We out here. Venus, what's up? Like, I had plans for like interga intergalactic like, like relationships. Like I was gonna create world peace with my gig. Somebody do it now. You know, give me credit though. But <laughs> favorite thing or food to order online favorite food is macaroni i don't eat people's macaroni like that i'll give anything a bite but i don't know i don't but in restaurants i feel like they always put their little twist on it and just add stuff that doesn't belong in there so i try not to i don't know i, I like macaroni but it's probably not even a thing favorite thing to order online okay um, I order a lot of like clothes and stuff online. I, yo, I, <laughs> I go like grocery shopping online, y'all. Amazon Prime is your friend. I don't get sick of it. I order toilet paper and I started doing that like two years ago because I walked out of probably Walmart one time holding like this big mega roll of like toilet paper because good toilet paper is life y'all your toy i don't care what anybody says your toilet paper tells you everything you need to know about a person if you walking around with that like can you 
you hear it like that type of toilet paper it's like and nobody's gonna say it but they're gonna judge you because what are you doing wiping with rocks it's 2020 y'all come on a little luxury never hurt um so i ordered toilet paper um i ordered toothpaste i order i used to order almond milk I ordered too much one time and Walmart put a block on me. <laughs> they, like, I, like, legitly, like, everything would be great. And I typed in my name and my address and they're like, no. <laughs> no. Sent some to my friend's house. After a while, they was like, we're on to you. No. Um, it's mostly all the big things that I didn't want to look stupid carrying out of the store. So, yeah. Um, I ordered a decent amount of clothes online. Um but kind of only if i know my size i don't i'm not big on like i will not return stuff at all like um i don't know if it's pride i don't know if i'm lazy but like if i if something doesn't fit or it's wrong i'll i'll give you that strongly worded email you will see this email but uh yeah i'm, I'm not about to return it so that's basically it this video is getting kind of long so i think i'm gonna turn it into a part two um Hopefully gonna um, upload them at the same time, don't know. But uh, part two, coming soon. Uh, add more questions, let me know like what else you're trying to do. Um, see y'all next time.